Hey, what's good guys? Welcome back to another video. So if you saw my other video earlier in the week about the legendary exploit or glitch or bug or whatever you want to call it where you had in 10 hunts and then you can either reload your game and it will give you a different legendary each time. Now there was a lot of comments from people saying they couldn't get specific legendaries that they actually wanted or they'd got everything apart from this certain one and different kind of things like that. So a bunch of people have been doing testing in the community about just what triggers certain legendaries to drop, what causes certain legendaries to be in the loot pool and what might cause legendaries to not be in a loot pool. And one theory that people have found is that if you only do certain expeditions and you haven't completed every single expedition there is, that in fact certain legendaries are actually locked behind certain expeditions. So let's just use the Death Shield as an example. Now what they're basically saying is, for example, if you wanted the Death Shield, in order for that to be in a drop pool, you would have to complete Boomtown. And then once you've completed Boomtown, it doesn't matter if it's on gold, silver or bronze, as long as you've completed it, get that added to your rotation of loot. And from there on out, it can, in theory, drop from anywhere. Now, we all know the best places to farm legendaries is, of course, Expedition. The second best place to farm is to do either the Historian, the Wanted, or the Hunter quest. Everyone knows once you've done 10 of those, you can add them in and get a legendary. So pretty much, guys, if you can't get certain legendaries to drop, it, you may need to go and do a certain expedition that you haven't done yet. For many of you, I'm sure it's Eye of the Storm. Now, once again, you don't have to get gold. You do not have to get gold. You have to get either gold, silver, or bronze. I'm pretty sure. And then once you've got that and you've completed it just one time, whether you're solo or in a group, it will actually add the legendaries that are locked behind that mission to the loot pool. So from the people that have tested it, that seems to be how it's working currently. I've seen comments in other videos saying that that is actually the case. They needed a certain expedition, so they went and did that. And then two or three expedition runs later, that legendary actually dropped for them. Granted, it could be coincidence, but it's a fair few people saying that. So I feel like that might actually be the case. I don't know if you've ever played division in the division there were certain raids and certain missions that you had to do in order to get a legendary or an exotic from them so it really wouldn't surprise me if this was similar in outriders now it's kind of annoying that they force us to play expedition in order to get certain legendaries personally i think you should be able to play the game at your own pace and if you want to farm monsters you can if you want to farm well tiers you can and you can still get every single legendary in the loot pool and have a chance of it dropping for you but i can also see the other side of it why they might force us to play expeditions because that is meant to be the end game content and they obviously he wants us to try that out and it would obviously give us a reason to do the expeditions but i thought i'd make a video on it because i have a feeling it might help quite a few of you i know there's a lot of you using the other video and re-rolling the legendaries from the hunt handing and you've been doing it for hours and hours and hours without any luck i would check and see if there's an expedition that you actually need and then go and do it and then maybe come back and roll some more and see if that legendary you need actually turns up again it's not 100 guaranteed and i don't know if it's 100 truthful but i thought i'd put it out here anyway because i know there's so many of you that need specific legendaries and I don't want you to sit there just wasting your time for hours on end hoping to get a legendary that isn't even in the loot pool for you So as always guys, I hope this helps you if you don't mind Please drop a like on the video while you're there hit that sub button for me And if you want to join our discord community the link will be in the description I'll catch you in the next video guys. Peace